Now to the protests erupting coast to coast over conditions at those migrant detention centers. The outrage this morning growing the revelation of a stunning new government report. It shows photographic evidence of the crisis. Migrants left standing in standing room cells for a week. ABC's Will Carr is there at the border again in San Diego with more. Good morning, Will. And good morning, Cecilia. We have seen a surge in families coming across the border for months, and now we're seeing the results. A new government report is taking us inside those detention centers along the border. This is what a ticking time bomb looks like, according to a facility manager inside an overpacked detention center in Texas. A new Homeland Security Inspector General report shows migrants wedged together inside overcrowded rooms. The picture is taken just three weeks ago. The OIG visited five centers in the Rio Grande Valley and found migrants lying on the floor. Wrapped in those silver mylar blankets, others packed into standing room only cells for more than a week. The government says children had no access to showers and limited clothing. Nationwide protest against the Trump administration's immigration policies and its treatment of refugees come after a congressional delegation snuck a cell phone into two facilities in Texas earlier this week, showing women wrapped in blue sleeping bags on the ground. Sarah Koskin brought her young sons. It is viscerally atrocious. On Tuesday, another group of Democratic lawmakers traveled to the nation's largest child detention center in Homestead, Florida. When you see something that is not right, not fair, not just, you have to say something. Close the camps now. Close the camps now. And President Trump just signed an emergency border spending bill that will continue border operations and it could expand shelters and provide medical help in the coming days and weeks. Wit. Will Carr at the border for us again this morning. Thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.